As children across central New York put the finishing touches on their Halloween costumes, one family is in the final stages of filling hundreds of Halloween buckets for the kids in their neighborhood. News Channel 9's Madison Moore spoke with the woman who started the initiative, and she says it's a reason that goes beyond Halloween fun. A tradition seven years in the making, 213 Midland Ave now serves as a one-stop shop on Halloween. But for Carletta Rice, it's not just about handing out the candy to the kids in her neighborhood. I just want them to be safe, come out, enjoy themselves. Once they get these baskets, it should be more than enough. Just go home, be safe. Don't go around to people's houses because it's not safe out here no more. Youth violence is on many of her neighbors' minds as it's touched even some of the streets in her own backyard. But Rice is hoping these buckets keep kids out of harm's way on Halloween night. Long as I can help, they're more welcome to come to 213 to Rice's take care of the kids. And the kids start lining up as early as 1 p.m. on Halloween. And this year, the Rice family plans to hand out more than 700 of these buckets filled with all sorts of goodies. After losing my son, I feel I need to do something, you know, for the community. And I just like reaching out. If I can help anybody, they come to me and I got it, they got it. And I try to do the best I can for my community. Spreading a message to her neighbors, not just on Halloween, but year round. In Syracuse, Madison Moore, News Channel 9. The Rice family will start handing out buckets at 3 p.m. tomorrow afternoon. And it's first come, first serve.